Retro Dude! Actually, this is Mario! I'm taking over Retro Dude! I'm only kidding. Hey uh, guys, it's Retro Dude here. How are we all doing tonight? Are we having fun playing some video games? I'd like to talk to you about a history about the Super Mario Land. Super Mario Land is a 1989 side-scoring platform game developed and published by Nintendo as a launch title for their Game Boy handheld Game Boy console. It is the first Mario game ever to be released under the handheld console in the gameplay similar to that of 1985 Super Mario Brothers, but resized for a smaller screen. The player advances Mario to the end of 12 levels by moving right right and jumping across platforms, avoiding enemies and pitfalls. Unlike the other Mario games, Super Mario Land is set Sar Saraza Land, a new environment depicted in the line art, and Mario pursues Princess Daisy. The game introduces a Gradius style shooting at levels. <clears throat> At uh, Nintendo CEO, Hiroshi Yamanuchi requested Game Boy creator Gunpei Yokoi, who's also created AK the Game Boy, Nintendo R&D 1, a developer of Mario game to sell the new console. It was the first portable version of Mario and was first to be made without Mario creator Yokoi Pustik Shigeru Shigeru Moto. Accordingly, the developer team shrunk the Mario gameplay elements for the device to use some of its elements inconsistently from the series. Super Mario Land was expected to showcase the console until Nintendo of America bundled Tetris with the new Game Boys. The game launched alongside the Game Boy First in Japan, April in 1989, and later worldwide. Super Mario Land was later released for the Nintendo 3DS via Virtual Console in 2011, again a launch title, which features some twerks in the game's presentation. So there you go, here's a bit of history. Also guys, there was actually a music video for this, it's by the Am Ambassadors of Funk, so go and download it on iTunes. Yes, that's the one. I think that's the one they did in. Is it Fort Park? Um, basically, the, Mar <laughs> the guy dressed up in a Mario suit, and then the, there's a music video, but it's obviously not on YouTube because of the stupid revert, stupid, stupid, stupid YouTube policies. I can't submit the link, so I couldn't find it anywhere. So you're gonna have to download the sound, or just buy the the EP. <clears throat> it's quite reasonable. I think I paid a fit, is it four, four pounds something, 29? You get four tracks and it's uh, all mixed and stuff. So check it out. Anyway, let us -a play Super Mario Land. Here we go. So yes. So can anyone hear me in the audio all right? Hopefully it should be okay. <laughs> yes. Hmm. Alright. So who here has got a Nintendo Switch? I bought one today. Very good. Yeah. I've been playing a bit of a Zelda Breath of the Wild. I tell you what though, I think it's going to win the same amount of gaming awards. Is it me or is the volume too loud? Let me just, sorry, let me just adjust the volume. It's a little bit loud. Uh, let's turn it down a bit. Oh. Right. Uh, don't know why, but okay. Uh, this is still a bit loud. Okay, anyone can hear me still? It's like Kate, I take it that's a yes. Alright. Where was I? Oh, yes. Yeah, it, uh, the Switch is easy to set up. You know, uh, the only diff the only problem I had with the Switch, I noticed that uh, it's the friends list is quite hidden. You have to click on the icon that your profile picture, and you can add friends and stuff. So I thought that's a little bit strange. Uh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, this game brings back so many memories. I mean, I 
I'll tell you one story about that, uh, that will make you uh, go, ooh, that's cool. My sister <clears throat> actually went into a shell shop back in the early 90s and she brought, she got a scratch card, so she was filling up a card and she brought home a she uh, scratched them off and she won a Game Boy with all three Game Boy icons. And I thought that was really cool, so we won a free Game Boy that came with Tetris. And I, we both just went, oh, this is incredible. So we didn't have to pay £90 back in the day, you know, when it was released. It's, it's so fantastic. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> I do like this game. I think, I think the problem with this game, a lot of people have mentioned it, it is quite easy to beat. Tell you what, if you could speed run this, you can easily finish this in under an hour, or maybe half an hour if you're really that confident. Because it is quite short, these 12 levels. <clears throat> I do like the fact that you, when you play more of this game, you actually get shoot 'em up sections, and you get submarine sections, airplane section. Sort of similar to the Batman game that I actually did a previous live stream of. <clears throat> and the basically is you got to go to the top, because that's where you get bonuses for extra lives. Okay. I'm not a big fan of the, <laughs> the randomness of this game. <laughs> and also, if you're curious about, there's a NES app you can actually uh, get on the Apple Store. And I actually got the soundtrack to this, so I listened to it on the go. All those tracks from this game you can download. It's class. I loved it. <clears throat> yeah, this gets a bit tricky now. Tricky. Well, not that really tricky. If you know where to go. Yeah. And uh, I have to. I had to come clean with something as well. I know everyone's going to probably scream at me right now, but I did see the Super Mario Brothers movie back in the day. And you're all going to probably crucify me now, but it, it, it wasn't that bad of a movie. Alright, it did have its flaws. I never liked the fact it was a sort of Blade Runner type of a movie. I mean, The Mushroom Kingdom? I went, okay. And I felt sorry for Bob Hoskins in that because he really hated being in that movie because the directors were changing script every so often that the, they got they had to change directors and and it tanked at the boss of, box office so I'm hoping that Nintendo now because they are going to make movies as well as theme parks you can go ahead now and actually Reintroduce to a new generation of kids and adults to Mario. Why not do that? That'd be really awesome. <clears throat> yeah. I would uh, highly re recommend uh, the Japanese movie version because that was done very well. It is basically a cartoon version and it's quite strange but. It, they got the uh, actual authenticity source material right. So go and check that out if you can. <clears throat> yes. Ooh. Yes, I like these. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Bit of a boo boo, but we go again. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, I'll see if, hopefully, if I complete this game under an hour, as I get basically said them a moment ago, you might see the ending, hopefully. Yes, and you got to rescue Daisy. Princess, uh, is it Daisy? Yeah, yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. And also, Mario has countless games, countless. You, you can... It will basically take you all day to list all the Mario games. It's insane. But I'll tell you what I'm really excited for is the Switch version of Mario's Odyssey. Now that game 
looks incredible. It's sort of... I wonder if it's a sequel to Super Mario Sunshine 2, but it's renamed differently. Do you think so, guys? That, that would be interesting. Because it's got that similar, you know, style gameplay, you know, the isometric sort of stylish, third person view. And a lot of people have actually said, and also when they commented on YouTube, that original trailer, it looks too much like Sonic, Sonic Adventure. And I went, I see where they got their complaints from, because the people and the cars, they look very similar. I don't know if that was intentional with Nintendo to do that. <laughs> they must have liked the Sonic game and went, oh, you know, we could do a Mario game. Why not? <laughs> now, if I can just, you got to jump in the right sort of angle. Get these coins here. No, 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 no. Wee. And then that's the problem and you can't get back. Oops. <laughs> Never mind. All right. Do -do, do -do, do -do. So I have the Nintendo Switch dock as well set up. I haven't actually used it yet. <clears throat> Looking forward to trying to see how it performs. I did hear from previous reviews of Zelda Breath of the Wild that it, it lagged bad, badly when it was docked. I don't know, however, it would be interesting to find out because they actually released a software update today, so it could be all hopefully smoothed out. You never know. Yeah. We'll find out hopefully after this stream. <laughs> I do like these stars. They do help you in the sticky situations. Ah, you miss me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh. Yes. So what would you what is your favourite Mario game? Anyone care to mention? <clears throat> I think I think what I I do cherish is Super Mario World because I remember going to America and playing this game with my cousin and I we both had a and we had a great time. You know, I I love the what are my favourite levels is one of the lava levels. And it had that uh, skull, skull moving platform, and it did this creepy uh, mellow vibe to it, and it, I really enjoyed it, and I was so thrilled. And the music, the gameplay, it was it was absolutely phenomenal back in the day. And SNES was just such a great console. Yeah, and of course Super Mario Bros. Three, you know the greatest, obviously. <clears throat> I actually got that on the Nintendo 3DS as well. I like to play that on the go. Relive the good old times, eh? <laughs> yes. Oh. Yes, these squids, you have to just try and duck them out. Yeah. I do like this, this level because it's a submarine. It's so cool. Da -da 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 -da. I like the fact that this level it spells coin spell out the word Mario. <clears throat> Fun, isn't it? <laughs> okay, here's the boss. Just basically shoot and just avoid his projectiles. Pretty simple. Hello, people. Oh, wait, sorry, it was Daisy, not Princess Peach. Yeah. Yes, they played this similar theme, and obviously the NES version, as you could tell. Teasing the player, you know, go to another castle. <laughs> and now 
now we're in Easter Island. <laughs> Has anyone actually been to Easter Island? <clears throat> Before? I never have. It would be interesting to go one day. Yeah. Yes. With all those those heads in the background, eh? Yeah. Oh dear. Not a good move. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Alright. Okay. Jumping up. I never like those turtles, they, they explode. That is such a strange thing to do. Oh, these bullet bills. Oh! You won't shoot me down. Oh! <laughs> I love how they die. You know, the sound is so class. It's like, yeah. Yeah. Well, let's hope Nintendo put, don't put a copyright strike on this stream. Yeah. Oh, that was useful. Whoop. Oh, All right. Yeah. Oh. Oof. Oompa. Woo! Woo! Oh dear. Oh dear. Hey guys, it is me, Mario. Do you think Regidor is playing so badly now? <laughs> hey Mario, give me a break. I like that the, these visible rocks just come flying at you. I think that's quite cool. Could you imagine that in real life? You'd go, wow, I'm falling over. <laughs> Mamma mia. <laughs> All right, I think there's one of those power-ups here. Hopefully, nope. Oh, you might also want to check out my previous stream. I've also done a sequel to this. Super Mario Land 2, the six golden coins. Check it out. Okay, see if I can get up here, get a power up. Beaut. Okay, can't turn this cool to zero. Huh? Okay. Yeah. I do love this stage. It's so cool, these spiders. Jump on them. <laughs> oh. oh, my bad. As they say, got plenty of lives. Not worried, to be honest. Yeah, right, just run through. Jump up this dude. Oh, these jumping spiders. Oh, sorry, Spidey. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. That was close. I think the secret step to this level is just try and take your time and pre precise your jumps carefully. That's it. Just like that. Oh, no! Darn that spider. Okay. Whoop. Come here, Spidey. It's like a donkey on the head. Donk. A donk, a donk. -a. Donk. Who? What? Oh, I didn't see that bullet bill coming at me. Good job. Oh, yeah. Oof. Ah, safe. Nice. Yes, yeah, very effective at jumping them, you know, try and hit them with the boxes. 
So we there explode. <clears throat> right, now we've got the rock, traveling rocks again. Ah, that's good. Alright. I gotta dunk you in the head. Oh, that was sly. Nicely done, Mario. Hey, thank you, Richard. It's all in the day's work. Uh, let's see if I get. Oh, no. Never mind. Okay. Do you, do you sometimes, when you play these games, your heart races like a crazy, crazy fast? <clears throat> I find that sometimes. I did that last week when I played one game, and you were just going like, Oh, oh my god, I can't believe I dodged that. That's what I'm feeling right now. I'm just going like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, oh, couldn't end that secret pipe, never mind. Uh, Okay. Ugh. Oh yes, that's useful. Get these coins in. Yep, nicely done. Oh yeah. I love these hidden blocks. They're very useful. Hmm. Uh. Oh yes. Thank God for hidden blocks. They do help. Oh, this bit. I'm gonna see if I can uh, yeah, just jump inward. This is like before Super Mario Raker, you know. Crazy. Whoop, there we are. That's alright now. Oh, darn it. These rolling rocks. Oh, fantastical. Gotta face the. Uh, you know what I'll do? I'll just jump over here. There you go. Done! Thank you, Mario! Oh, Daisy! Mamma mia! When she turned into a spider, is it Spider-Man? Spider-Man, spider No! Scrap that. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can get five flat. Yes! Fantastical. Just what I need. And now we have the greatest music ever composed. I seriously love this. You can sing, you can hum this tune all day and it's still great. <laughs> Okay, let's jump on these platforms. We oui. do. Dunk them on the head. Dunk. Thank God, thank goodness for fireballs. They are really your best friend. Try and keep it if you can as well. It's very useful for boss battles. <clears throat> And these piranha plants, you're gonna need them. See? Whoop. Whoop. Yup. Ah. I'm not. Yeah, that's a, that's a bit annoying thing about this. This is because it can find. Oh no, I lost it. Oh, okay. Oh no. Oh no, I am so small. Okay. Oh, nicely dunked. Oh no. Okay, jump in it use.
What? Oh yeah, to be grown to defeat them? Yeah. That's the annoying thing about this. Uh... Oh. Oof. Whoa. Uh. That's the secret trick, is try and do a, a dog jump up. That helps as well. Okay, let's see if we can get three lives. Can we do it? Oh, okay. Excellent. Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Oh yeah, now we got these fire plants. Got to kill. <laughs> Luckily, only take a couple of hits from the fire flower. Eee, then I, then I blew it. Bye, snake. Hmm. Oh. Gotta get in. Get in. Hmm. What if I get the power up here? Nope. Right, smoothly does it. Okay, go on, Mr. Browner Blunt. Let's see if I can get it. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh. oh, nuts. Didn't get the star power up. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, why? Hmm. Let's see if I can do it without. Uh, yeah, just got. Sorry about this, guys. You know, um, <laughs> these these fireball rings are annoying sometimes. Oh no, he forgot flame up his bum. Ooh. I say alley oop. Oh, come on, not now, please. Not when I'm streaming live to these wonderful people. I hope you're enjoying this stream as much as I am enjoying playing this game. Get the star power up. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, uh, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. Get this snake. For, get this dude. All right. Just got to time this right. Donk him. Now get out of the way. We explodes. And then run like mad! Wee! Hmm, let's go time this jump. Easy done. Okay. Whew! Alright. Onward to the next level. Yeah. Hey, thank God I got a little more lives than anybody. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, like, i seen this on the advert. I remember it very well. Uh, I, I said to my mom, you know, can you give me this game? Because this sold me, you know, this stage. Because I love airplanes and you, in fact, you're shooting down birds. Boids. <laughs> yes, I'm, I like to use the American slang sometimes, so... <laughs> It's quite fun, fun, straightforward stage. I think this might be the last level, I think. 
Yeah, it must be. Yeah. Oh, I missed that star. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Whoa. Well, at least this is the easier stage than Battletoads. Oh, Christ. If you play the Game Boy version, it is so hard, you know, when they go speed it up faster. <clears throat> but at least this is pretty simple, straightforward. And there we go. I'm going to just go down here. Up and round and down. Whee! Do 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 Right, it's got to avoid these flaming spiral balls. <laughs> I love the fact they put fists in these things. Okay. Oh, these birds. They come in a weird formation pattern. As they say, do try and do like a rectangle pattern. Does help. Oh yeah, this is the actual boss now. Yeah. Okay, you and me are going down. I'm gonna take you out, and we go for another spaghetti and a pizza pie. <laughs> it's pretty simple. It's very similar to Batman on the Game Boy. Just avoid the bullets in a circle and just go in between and just keep shooting. And there you go. And this is the end, guys. Here is the ending. Enjoy. I like this ending. It's so nice. It's just a nice way to end the game. Very light, very heartwarming, <clears throat> and joyful. <clears throat> so, guys, what do you think? Did you enjoy the gameplay? I suppose I'll end this stream now because it's, this is finished now. So, anyway, guys. And uh, next next Friday I'll be streaming Killer Instinct on the NES on the SNES. Sorry, I nearly said NES. I don't know why I said that. On the SNES, I meant to say, the Great Black Cartridge. Yes. So if, please smash, please hit that like button and hit the bell notification icon as well to keep informed of my next future uploads. Anyway, guys, please rate, comment. And subscribe. And as Retro Do City says, have a great weekend and good night to all. I'll wait. Tell you what, I'll let you see the credits before I finish this stream. <laughs>